Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to play some top ladder matches And right now, I'm going to use this Hoggis deck, it's already uh, meta deck, still in the meta It's been in the meta like in 2 or, two or 3 months I think And I'm about top 50 right now in top ladder We're in the 2 last days of the season, so it's this 2 last days is the Is where there's like more better opponents and everyone in the top is really good. So first match we're gonna go versus this Golem deck. He's using it with Golden Knight and Baby Dragon. I'm already gonna defend it here with the Queen. It wasn't really this Queen wasn't really good because I could like make her be alive to get a counter attack. Okay, and I think in this matchup versus Golem, you have to get a lot of damage. Try to get a lot of damage in single elixir to be like relaxed in double elixir. You just try to defend the Golem push because the Golem push is going to be really hard to defend. And here I'm going to already cycle some um, earthquakes with Fire Spirit there too. Try to get some damage as much as possible to when it goes with to double elixir gonna be more comfortable okay here i'm gonna put my skellies to protect my archer queen protecting the archer queen too is really important versus especially versus golden decks because he has to use like a really big spell to try to take that archer queen out or he has to tornado everything so it's really important to protect her and right now he activated sour but i needed to put that hog is there I didn't have like any options. Okay, he started with the golem here and double elixir. Already uh, attacked with hogs here. I need to get some damage. I know it's like in the same lane, it's gonna give, give some counter attack. But I needed to put that hoggies. We got it to 1500. I already cycled my first cannon there. Just like for like four more cards, I have another cannon. Put my Arch Queen here in the back. Use the ability. It's gonna kill the Electro Giant. And I have another the other cannon again. We're gonna have to cycle really fast here. This road delivery wasn't really good. Okay, we needed to use our Huggies here to defend the baby dragon. It's not like a big problem. You use like very hogs on defense if needed. Here I needed to put that cannon, my road delivery here. It's a really complicated defense right now. My fire spirits here, my skeletons. Nice that he used the he used the the dash of the golden knight on the skellies and didn't get to the tower. Use my archie queen here and use the ability too. And this was a really good tornado by him. I needed to use my royal delivery here with the fire spirit, and he keep pressuring the the bridge. I had it to keep defending right now. Put my skellies here. Or hogs try to try to pressure him because I wasn't attacking. I didn't attack right now. Defended with Barbro, Baby Dragon, Electro Giant. Electro Dragon. Put my Queen here with my delivery. Really good defense right now. And that Golden Knight dash on the skeleton, so. Right now I'm just gonna attack with Hogs and this probably is gonna be game. I think this doesn't have elixir. You just turn it up there. I need to cycle just to one more log and one more earthquake and probably GG. Or delivery cannon here, put it up high just to keep the golden golden knight not to dash the tower. Log earthquake and GG. So this was a really good match. And he didn't have lightning, so it's really better for us. Let's go to our second match, and it's versus Low. Oh, so this guy, he usually uses that Royal Giant deck with Skeleton King, Mother Witch, and Zappies with Fireball and the Skeleton Army. And this deck, I really like it too. It's a really strong deck in the meta. It's one of my favorites too. But we're. My Hoggy's deck, I think we have a bit of an advantage. Because we could like we could cycle a lot of earthquakes on the tower. He needs to use He doesn't have like really good defense for my hoggies. 
He has the fireball and skeleton king, but I could like bait him with the, the queen. The, yeah, the, this this matchup the queen gets a lot of value. If you play her really well, she could like kill the Roy Giant push just her using the ability too. But starting here, I'm gonna like start starting play calm. Put my can here or delivery. And I think, yeah, I'm going to go Hoggies here because he doesn't have the Skeleton King and he has to, like, waste Fireball. And he wasted his Fireball, but the Hoggies still is going to get some damage there. And in Single Elixir, I'm going to, like, keep cycling Earthquakes and Earthquakes along the tower. If needed, I'm going to attack with Hoggies. But just if he doesn't have that Skeleton King in cycle because... The Skeleton King is going to give like a really good counter attack and it could be like really hard to defend it. Here we're going to click that Mother Witch just so she does not like give a lot of problems for my for my defense here. Put my Arch Queen here in the back. If he comes with RG, I put the, the Arch Queen there. I'm going to log it back. If you use the ability here, I'm going to use my ability too. He didn't use it, so it was good. I'm gonna use my Blade of the Arch Queen here. We're gonna log two. And nice, we're gonna, we're gonna get the More the Witch there. Already gonna attack with Hoggies. He's a lot of Elixir on the defense. But right now, we have to be careful because he could come with Thor Giant there. And he came. I'm gonna cycle to my Archer Queen. Use my ability. Use the logs to get those those skellies need to take to another cannon i put it on top of the aura giant and we just need to keep like repeating this defense putting the, the cannon putting the archer queen on the right lane on the opposite line of the of the cannon okay like keep spreading the cards too okay here's gonna using the skeleton armor just to bait my my forgot the name my spells i use my arch queen here my fire spur just to kill all the skellies and it still got a hit and he passed on on damage from me i needed to attack right now so i put my hoggies there my earthquake we got some good damage yeah right now we can't like let him hit anymore we have to play really defensive just cycle i think i'm not like gonna play any hoggies right now we're just gonna play cycle and then cycle some earthquakes. Yeah, I'm really gonna. No, not yet. I'm gonna put my Arja Queen here because he's gonna go in with the uh, Royal Giant, Skeleton King, Log here. I already have the other cannon. So this this deck cycles so fast. You have to you have two cannons there. So I'm gonna already pressure with Hoggies. Earthquake for the Mother Witch. It's gonna kill the mother witch. The earthquake log kills the mother mother witch, so it was really good. We're gonna attack with hogs again. He doesn't have the fireball and cycle, and I already cycled my earthquake. Okay, right now I'm just gonna cycle earthquakes right now. I think two more earthquakes than this. Yeah, two more earthquakes. Log here, fire spray. The cannon is the cannon is really good on defense versus the Roy giant. He needs to like use a use a spell to take it out. Here I'm just gonna cycle back to my earthquake. This is yeah, this is probably game in yeah GG. And this matches for us, but he put it really well too. And let's go to our third match versus Uero. He's a really good bridge spam player. He plays like he keeps uh keep he keeps changing the variations. Sometimes he plays with Mega Knight Rim Rider. Sometimes he plays that Lumberjack Rim Rider with Golden Knight and Ghost with Infernal Dragon. And he uses Pekka too. Uh, but this time he was using that Golden Knight with Lumberjack and Bandit, that spam deck. And I think here we, we have a really good matchup. We just have to like play really defensive and just attack when needed. When like he overcommits or when he doesn't have elixir. 
And it's okay. Right now, single elixir is gonna like keep cycling some earthquakes on the tower, fire spirits on the bridge, try to force like some troops for him. And the Archer Queen is gonna get a lot of value too because he does he just has fireball for the Archer Queen. So I have to like abuse our Arch Queen in defense. Use the ability too. And here this was a really good good night golden knight because he knew that like I didn't have any troops. I used that scatties. I used my my fire spirit too. I just had that Archie Queen and he came pressuring here. I think this was really really aggressive. I had elixir but I just like didn't have the right troops but I use that hogs in defense not a big problem and it's gonna get like some good damage on the counter attack we got it to 3300 so it was a really good defense already attacking here it doesn't have magic archer so it's not gonna be a big problem the, the magic archer and the bridge is it's like really annoying and Nice, he doesn't, he doesn't have it here. Okay, defense with Ram Rider. I put my Archie Queen here. Already on the top. Log here just to push it. I'm not, not going to get to the tower. I, yeah, he didn't get to the tower. He first the Fireball here on the Huggies. Already going to use my ability on the Archie Queen. Nice, I forced the Barbara there. Put my Skadis here. On top of the, the Ghost. Okay, now we're just gonna play full defensive, but my cannon separated from my archer queen. Okay, we're delivery here. Just gonna do we're delivery just to stop that dash on the queen. Scatty's here to protect my cannon from the from the ghost. Here I'm just gonna log in delivery. It's gonna resolve it here. Look at that right lane. The archer queen got a lot of damage. And I'm already gonna yeah go and attack with Augies here. He didn't use his fireball, so he's gonna receive some good damage there. Left lane, I used my skeleton for the for the ghost. Okay, here I'm gonna put my archer queen in the middle. He's gonna get everything that he's attacking. Okay, we're delivery there. So this is a strange word delivery, but okay. I'll put my log here. Push everything back. Nice, they killed the ghost too. So we're really looking really good. Just keep defending. Put my archer queen here. You can in the defense. You have to be careful because this bridge frame is really, really dangerous. <coughs> really dangerous sometimes. Okay, we're gonna put my royal delivery. My ability here, just to kill that golden knight. Golden knight is really, a really annoying card to win this matchup. Because any dash, she could like be crazy, and I'm not gonna expect it. Keep uh, put, yeah. Keep putting my archer queen in the back. He doesn't have nothing to take it out, so the archer queen is like it's invincible. Just if he fireballs and arrows, but he doesn't have arrows. Skeleton here. Keep cycling here. Cycle as much cannons as you can here too. The cannon is a really good DPS damage. For delivery, fire spirit cannon again. And this deck cycles so fast, so he doesn't have like. He can't do nothing in this matchup, but yeah, this is GG. He already fired while the King Tower. And we played really well here. And he had a really good matchup here, too, so. That was a good game. So that was the video, guys. I hope you guys liked it. And don't forget to subscribe and leave a like in this in this video. So yeah, see you in the next one.